Um, First of all, how, how are you feeling about your game? Uh, better and better. Uh, starting, you know, get back in the swing of things. Um, good to get some wins here with the guys too. Yesterday, you know, you guys are closing out a homestand. It's a six-game homestand. Uh, an important game, obviously, against a Central Division rival. It seemed like almost like a carbon copy of yesterday's game, at least from my perception. Uh, you guys had a good first period. They pushed back in the second, and third was kind of a little bit of a, you know, territorial battle. Is that how you saw it? Yeah. Uh, for a uh, majority of the game, I liked how our team played, and uh, you know, the coach, coach just harp on you know doing our system and doing our jobs, and and, and then it just comes down to execution once we do that. So um, I liked it. On your first of all, what did you see on your goal, and then right after your goal, you almost had a breakaway chance. Are you, are you just feeling good right now? The legs are feeling good. Yeah, it uh, just takes a little time when you have time off to get the get your legs under you. Um, that goal, I think, tipped off a stick or something and, and went in. So that was kind of lucky, kind of fortunate, but but I'll take it. Um, the guys were playing well. We were moving around well, so it was good. Good win for us. We, we've talked, it seems like all season, about how well your goalies played. Eric Comrie's been phenomenal. I think seven two zero and one in his last mm -hmm. ten games. But part of his success, I think, is also the team concept of the fact that you guys are not allowing a lot of second and third chances against him. Is that something you guys are really focusing on? Yeah, Eric's a guy, he, he works so hard. And uh, whether the team was having success or not at different points this year, he was always battling and, you know, and, and never uh, put guys on the bus and, and just comes to work every day. And that's something we, we want to try to reward him and play hard for him. So uh, I'm just happy for him, yeah. Speaking of success, you guys are having success now, and you're pushing yourselves back into that playoff race. What does that mean to you? Because I know obviously you were hurt, but now you're feeling good again. And, and the fact is, the team and a lot of the players are talking about that internal reset that they've hit. So just how important was this homestand and now going out on the road for six? Yeah, um, beginning of this homestand, coach called us in, and uh, we had a, a meeting one morning just talking about second half of the season and the numbers and what kind of what kind of games we had to put up, what kind of wins we had to string together. and type of hockey we needed to play and it kind of uh, refocused everyone and had that reset like you said and uh, since then it's been a little bit it's just been focused and execution has been there so it's been good star wars guy or not star wars, star wars guy i enjoy star wars yes <laughs> maybe were you paying attention to some of the things in there yeah i liked i saw a lot of wookie masses out there and uh, a couple darts it was good I just wanted to ask you about uh, your your unit. The defensive the defenseman had three goals tonight. It's the first time that's happened this season. What are you thinking about the group right now? Uh, you know, I, I liked our game. Whether whether we scored the goals or not, it's it's more about uh, you know not scoring it. And if we can get offense, that's great too. So we'll take it though. We're happy with it. Anything you guys are going to take on the road from you, like pillows or something like that, that can sort of help with uh, the transition to the roads again? Lucky, some lucky charms to bring with. Uh, I I don't know. It's just a good vibe in the room right now, and guys are settling in and uh, just some positive energy.